What's up, y'all? Jason Jono here, and welcome back to Let's Play Grand Theft Auto V. So the last episode was pretty short, where we look at um, Trevor Industries, which basically I think he sells drugs and meth. But I guess it's sort of a short um, introductory. To Travis' character, like what his background is, what has what he has been doing for the past couple of years after that first heist, and I'm pretty sure that the stories with these missions will get longer once he um, meet up with Michael and Franklin. So let's see what these guys had to say. Trevor. Ron, what's up, Ron? They were here for you, here for you. Who was here? Them bikers. After you killed Johnny K. And they damage my stuff, huh? They smash up my home, damage my soul. This, 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 this statue here of impotent rage, this fucking meant more to me than Johnny K meant to anyone, and they smashed it. Those pathetic, midlife crisis, hog riding, shaven headed, fruity leather, chap wearing fucking assholes. They're assholes, Trevor, they are. They're chap. We're in asshole. Uh oh, wait, 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 you little shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, Michael fucking Townley, right? Bitch wife, two kids, 45. Find him. Los Santos is a big, big place, Trevor. There's lots of people. You are fucking useless. Huh? Find out who did that fucking robbery, all right? And if Michael Townley lives there or anyone matching his description, I'm going to kill you and your fucking cousin. Am I being clear now? Yes, Trevor. Thank you. Now smile. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. All right. That's better. Run along. Uh, <laughs> now, Ron. Shall we go? Cannot believe that they fucking destroyed my statue of impotent rage. The cheek, huh? The fucking cheek of it. <laughs> the statue of impotent rage. I gotta make a stop at ammunition. You're meeting me at the Lost MC's airfield. Right, on to ammunition to pick up some, I don't know, guns or some upgrades, whatnot. We shall see what come Trevor come wants. In. I'll come in your ear when I get a hold of you. Oh, what are you buying at the gun shop? I'm not buying anything. I need a sniper rifle with a high power scope. Oh. Alright, you, you want a high power sniper rifle with a good scope, but you're not buying it. So, are we taking it by force? Sounds like Trevor. Melvin, how you feel about brand synergy, huh? TP Industries, ammunition. Good, because you're about to make a corporate gift of a rifle, a high-powered scope, and a suppressor. <laughs> I'll take whatever you want, Trevor. I can't afford another fire. All right. That's the rifle I need. So everything else is locked or still cost money, but. The rifle is free, so That's hell yeah! You got a scope and a suppressor for this? A band scope, a suppressor. It'll be quiet as a mouse. All right, now stop selling weapons to that halfwit Cletus. All right, so we got a sniper rifle now. I'm getting super excited about what he's what Trevor's gonna do with this sniper rifle. It's probably some crazy ass sniping shit that we'll be doing in this episode. So Run. stick Run. around, the check it out. The water tower just north of the airfield. Roger that, Trevor. But you gotta look out, cause there's bikers all over this airstrip. Of course there are. Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons Ooh. run. Out. Fuck. Of course there are! Two planes are touching down at the field on a weapons run! We're gonna wait till the right time and appropriate them! We are? Yes, we are! Where are you, man? I'm waiting at the water tower! Yeah, I'm here, I'm asshole. Here. I don't see the hardware, but I do see a hell of a lot of bikers. Hardware's not here yet. Coming up. I'd be all the way up there if it wasn't for my knee. You wuss. 
All right, I'm here. What do I need to do? Oh. So we waited until the what? Why would I want to wait one whole Enough night for that? You. This is your moment, Ronald. Whenever you get a doubt in your mind, I want you to remember that I am watching you through the scope of a high-powered rifle. Right, Trevor. Right, right. Got it. Now relax. The ATV can only take you so far. Park it and don't let them spot you. Can you see me, Trevor? Over by the road. What? You wouldn't believe this, Ron. One of these assholes is having a seizure or something. That's me. That's me. Don't shoot. <laughs> Who the hell is he? Move on. Oh, there it is. Just keep me covered, okay? Hold up. There's a guard standing under the control tower. This guy? Boom. Uh oh. Oh. Good kill, Trevor. You're walking like you shot yourself. Move. You hear that? I can hear an engine. They'll see that body. Maybe if you shoot those lights on the tower, it won't be so obvious. All right. There's one. And there's the other. Lights off. Good. Now don't smoke the guy in the van until he stops and gets out. All right. Yeah, I'm sure that that body wasn't obvious, but all right. Oh, fire. We gotta see what he's up to. He's up to nothing, he's that's what. The dead guy. You can erase him now. He's out. You can put him down. If the man wants to pay his respects, I ain't one to cut that short. Don't joke. He's right there. All right, all right. You should have seen the look on his face. There's a guy coming out of the control tower. Take him out. Shit. He's gonna Where? Us. Where? Where is this guy coming out from the control tower? He's gotta go. What? Where is this motherfucker? Oh, there he is. Uh-oh. Down he goes. All right, that was kind of close. Oh, no. Bottom of the tower. Another guy's on his way. He's down there amongst the bodies. Okay. I'll get to him. Boom. He's about to get his brothers. But yeah, he has just joined his brothers, baby. Not anymore. Long, sailor. Get your sights back on me, Trev. I'm scared. You Come wuss. On, cover me. I Covering you, you sight, asshole. So get a move on and plant that bomb on the gas tank. I'm on it, but there's a guy coming out of that building, I think. I can hear him. What are you, Superman? Well, how do you How do you hear all these things? Um, where? Oh, there he is. Somebody. There's a second guy coming out of the building. Are you scared now, bitch? Are you scared now? No, he won't. All right, just hurry it up. Put Ron in your tank. All right. Fixing it. Don't let him sneak up on me, okay? All right, all right. And watch out for the tank. It'll go up if you hit it. I think someone's coming. Shit. Shit. He's on to me. Where? He knows I'm here. No, he's not. Good eye, baby. From the blue. What? 
So are you a saying? I'm just too pro, baby. Ain't messing with me. All right, Ron. Come on, buddy. Obviously. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's not good. Not good. Get off the bike. Get off the bike, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What? Oh, what the? Oh, no. No. What the? No, 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 no. Oh, stupid. I wasn't holding onto any weapon. Oh, and it messed up the controls. Ah. No, I don't I don't want that. How do I bring up the The pilot plant didn't work, but they know they're being attacked. Alright, alright. All right, so I want to take out a the assault rifle and let's go to town on this motherfuckers. All right, die, please. Anyone else? All right, there's another one. Where is Ron? That is the question. Um, can I come over here? Yes, I can. What the hell? Oh, sorry. Bam. It's to the best of us. Now start that plane. I hope there's enough of these guns. Holy shit. To go around. Come on, buddy. Headshot. Shouldn't we go find the guys who came to the trailer? No, we should secure this fucking hardware. One more guy around here. Oh, you're so tough now, huh? Shut up. I'm trying to take out this guy. All right. So let's get on the plane. Let's get on the plane. All right, shut up, bitch. Plane's loaded up with crates, Trevor. Just like you said. Rest of the gun. What? Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> this is so insane. Fuck you, man. Get me to that place. Come on, let's go, let's go. Where, where, where? What explosive? Boom. Holy shit! What the hell? What? How many of these guys are there? You got that right. Excuse me. Well, 
if a man on my wing presents no immediate danger, I'll do my best to oblige you. He's still there! So, uh, who might this buyer be? There's only two places this kind of hardware is gonna go. And they are? Up north to our Canadian cousins, where the lost were likely to be sending them. Oh my god, it's so cool. Neighbors, those in the south are Mexican brethren. I assume you got all kinds of connections in Canada. Why would you make an assumption like that? It's obvious. Why is it obvious? Spell it out for me before I order you to fly that plane into a mountain. Um, well, but because of where you used to operate, weren't you pulling scores in North Yankton and running cargo uh -oh, over uh -oh. the border? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah sure I was. All right, um, the plane is not exactly the easiest thing to control, but I guess we are doing well, I guess. This is so cool. Epicness and overwhelm by the... This beautiful scenery. I have no idea where we're going though, but who gives a shit? Let's just enjoy. The fact that we are here. You think that's your guy? Where? It be. Oh, there it is. We're over the Pacific Ocean. Alright. I'm actually lower than you. Uh oh, uh oh. Alright, we're here. Drop the cargo near the boat. Drop it. Uh oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. How was I supposed to fly the plane and know which button to do press? That was so unfair. That was ridiculous. Oh my god. Well, I'm glad that we didn't have to do all the flying over again, but the guy is still on the plane. What the shit? Hey, there's a biker on your wing, Trevor. I am aware of this. Oh, the you gotta get him off. Do a roll or something. Well, he's off. So, uh, who might this buyer be? So, as always, we're back here. Now, I wanted to drop the cargo. Let's drop it. That is that, my friend. Successfully delivered, Ron. Now, remember, if you beat me to the airstrip, I'll butcher your carcass and wrap you in cheesecloth. All right. Raise Ron to the airship. What do you Maybe think? You'll see. Uh, I ain't a trained Air Force pilot like you. I can just about get where I'm going, but I don't got much choice over whether it's fast or slow. Then get better at it, or fly through a barn. <laughs> Would a barn slow me down? Yeah, it might do. Or it might kill you instead. I'm just gonna fly normal, and I'll rely on you getting there quicker. You're braver than I thought. Keep low over the swamp, boss. Why? Why would I want to do that? So the guns are going to Mexico? Mexico, yep. Guy in the boat is Oscar Guzman. He's in with the cartels. If there's a market, this could be a way to expand the business. Like I hadn't thought of that? We might be able to buy into Oscar's thing, but leave that to me, Ron. I'm sorry to ask this, but does your contact pay well for this kind of shipment? Because I've got those lawyer fees for the divorce, and my settlement costs. Oh, he pays. Better than any in this sorry country. That's good to hear, man. We'll talk about the exact split when we're grounded, okay? All right, T.
All right. Was it as smooth? Wasn't as smooth as I wanted, but at least we landed safely. And oh my god, I must crash into something. So, what do I want to do? What am I supposed to do? We can reverse this bad boy up, and yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Um, we need to turn it slowly into the hangar. All right. I think that was adequate restitution for my impotent rage statue. That was a mighty fine statue, Trev. That was a mighty fine piece of plastic shit. But there is no price for emotional attachment. I mean, you might forego your cut to uh, alleviate my heartache. I might. Yeah, I mean, I will. Good idea. We don't have time to dwell on that now. Because we got more runs, Ron. If there is one thing that they need south of that big fence, it is guns. <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Technical expertise, hmm? managerial innovations, unstoppable. Oh, that's right. Now go. I need to meditate. Meditate? Or masturbate. <laughs> or both. The letter sounds more appropriate. So now I can purchase various properties to San Andreas. All right. So I guess this is where I will call this episode. So as always, if you like the epicness of what has been going on through Grand Theft Auto 5, please remember to leave a like and comment down below. It would help out a great ton. And of course, hit the subscribe button to be notified about future gameplays of Grand Theft Auto 5. And with that, I thank you guys for watching. My name is Jason Jono, and I will see you next time.